The two activists allegedly abducted over their opposition to Manila Bay reclamation projects have been released. Junila Castro and Jed Tamano appeared to have blindsided authorities yesterday when they revealed they were taken by the military in the NTF LCAC's own press conference. Authorities claim the two surrendered willingly after leaving the communist movement. Tamano and Castro says though that they were abducted by the military while they were walking in Orion Bataan on September 12. This contradicts the Philippine Army's statement that the two activists traveled from Bataan to Pampanga seeking to surrender until they eventually did so in Bulacan. They added that they were coerced into signing an affidavit during their supposed surrender. Ang totoo po eh, inukot kami ng mga militar sa kainang bay. Napilitan din kami na sumorender. Dahil pinagbantaan yung buhay namin. Yun po ang totoo. So wala naman po kami sa bundok. Hindi po kami armado. Tapos dudukotin niyo po kami. Ano po karapatan niyo para gawin yun? 70th Infantry Battalion Commander Lieutenant Colonel Ronel De La Cruz denied knowing of the alleged abductions, saying he was not even present when Tamano and Castor signed their affidavit. Meanwhile, NTF LCAC stood by the Army's version of events. <laughs>